When leaving a narcissistic or toxic relationship, always remember these three words, just keep swimming. And of course, if you're new here, I'm a narcissist. I actually have narcissistic personality disorder. Just Keep Swimming is a reference to the movie Finding Nemo when Dory and Marlin came up to the trench. And you remember the turtle said earlier, hey, look, don't go, don't go above the trench. You have to go through the trench. I take that as sometimes you have to go through it. You can't go around the danger. You can't go above it or underneath it. You have to go through it. Although you don't know what's in this trench. Although you don't know what stands on the other side of this trench when you leave a toxic relationship. But you swim into the trench, right? You're leaving the toxicity behind you. You can't see straight. Just keep swimming. When you hear the voices behind you say, hey, I'll go to therapy. Hey, I'll get better. Hey, I promise you I'll change. Hey, I'm sorry for everything. Just keep swimming. Because although you don't know what's on the other side of this trench, although you don't know what's on the other side of leaving this toxic relationship, you know what's behind you. You know what waits back there, don't you? Just keep swimming. Just keep moving forward. Literally, y'all, just keep swimming. Just keep moving forward. We want to pick up the phone and call them because it hurts so bad, because your stomach hurts, because your heart hurts, because you can't eat, you can't drink. Just keep swimming. When they show up at your house, banging on the front door, begging for another chance, just keep swimming. Just keep swimming, y'all. Seriously. When they show you show up to your job, begging, sending flowers to your work, sending sending mail and flowers to your house. Just keep swimming. Just keep going forward. Because on the other side of this trench, although you don't know what's over there. There's, there's other survivors. There's other people who've gotten through similar situations. There's a community of people that could be waiting for you to help you out. But unless you keep swimming, you will never experience that. When they're reaching out to your friends and family saying, oh, I'm going to hurt myself if they don't call me. Just keep swimming. When they just straight up call you directly and tell you that they're going to take, try to take their own life or they're going to run their car into a tree or they're going to go hang themselves in the garage or they're going to do something har to harm themselves or to harm you. Just keep swimming. When the pain gets unbearable, you cannot stop thinking about them. When you cry yourself to sleep, and you cry the first thing in the morning. Just keep swimming. Because you cannot go around this, y'all. You have to go through this. You have to go through this pain. You have to go through this trench to get to healing. Because although you don't know it, because although it's a deep, dark trench, right? On the other side of it is healing. On the other side of it is the possibility of happiness. Just keep swimming. Yeah, sometimes you might get drawn back. You know how water works. Sometimes you might get pulled back into pulled back out of the trench, back into this toxicity, and you end up leaving again. This time, don't don't turn back. Don't look behind you. Look forward. Just keep swimming. Because on the other side of this trench, on the other side of this pain, on the other side of this hurt, I promise you, I promise you, it gets it gets better. Tell yourself the truth. Close your eyes and just keep swimming. And keep swimming straight to my YouTube channel if y'all haven't already subscribed at Mental Illness. Thank you.